how to forget military habits and become a civilian painlessly is the main course at this center. And one of the steps in the process will be an interview with a specialist who can tell you just about anything you want to know. This man's job isn't to tell you what to do when you leave the Navy. That's up to you. Right on in. I see by your check sheets you're interested in getting your old job back again. Yeah, well, it's a good job, but can I get it? The law says your boss must give you your old job back, or one equally as good, provided it wasn't a temporary one. Now, we'll let him know you're out of the Navy. You be sure to either go in and see him or write him a letter within 90 days. Ask your interviewer every question that's in your mind, because the Navy has trained him to give you straight answers to anything you want to know. Well, what if I want to change jobs later? What about my insurance? Well, I never had a job. What do I do? Where do I learn a trade? In addition to these general interviewers, the Navy has provided for trained officers and civilians to answer any special problems you may have. Experts are available on insurance, pensions, civil service jobs, legal problems and loans for farms or businesses, education at government expense, job analysis. They have the answers to any questions you may have. I'd like to go to college, but I haven't enough money. All right, I'm going to suggest you drop in to see our education expert. He'll be able to give you all the information on any college you're interested in. Now, also, when you get home, another thing these interviewers will do for you is make out what is known as a referral sheet. It will tell you where to go and whom to see in your hometown for help or information after you leave the Navy. Remember, the Navy is interested in how you get along. In each naval district, we have what we call a civil readjustment officer whose job is to help you get squared away in civilian life. So feel free to drop in to see him or write to him if you have any problem. Oh, well, that's fair enough. Fine. Now, don't forget, you've got to check with your draft board within 10 days after leaving here. If you've lost your draft card or if you never had one or if the Navy picked it up when you came in, you'll have to get another one immediately. But don't worry. You won't mind as much this time as you did the last. 